time is a gift and I, I need to enjoy the gift that God has given me. And I also, it's, it's a, certainly in central London, it's a massive issue for people. Uh, lives are busy and it's easy just to listen to the voice that shouts loudest uh, and do whatever they want rather than perhaps what is best. Uh, and often the voices, the people you need to be spending time with are not shouting. Uh, so you need to think hard and, and sort of determine in advance, OK, this is how I think God has told me to use my time or desires me to use my time. I'm going to run with that uh, and seek to please him first and foremost. So what words of wisdom can you give um, anyone who's listening right now thinking, you know what, it's like me sometimes, you feel a bit anxious about trying to do everything. So what, what words of wisdom would you give? I'm not sure there's a there's a short pad answer. Uh, there's no silver bullet. Partly it's okay. Let's let's get some parameters in place biblically, and then you do need to you do need to go step back a little bit, carve out some time, in order to think. Okay, person that I am, gifts that I've got, circumstances of life. How how should I use my time? The commitments, obligations I have, and that's going to vary. Actually, you can't determine it once and for all. You, as a this year, things you set up, and think, I'm very happy. I'm investing this amount of time at church, and I can commit to this, and uh, and work requires me here. But next year, your mum's really unwell and sick, and you have to visit her uh, on a weekly basis or something, daily basis. Everything, so it varies from year to year. But it's once it's just being clear. Here are the things I must do biblically. Now this year, how, how does that look? What's that going to look like? And you've got to get the counsel of others involved as well to help you. I know it's um it, it is it is in the modern world we live in that we try and just to to fit lots of things in but sometimes I guess guess it's a it ha- is having uh, just like it's like boundaries isn't it sometimes we're trying to please people yeah we're trying to please our family trying to please our boss trying to please our church and and in that in that respect we end up taking on too much and then we get angry at them and then ourselves for say not saying no so is it about boundaries. Uh, in, in part, that's right. Um, sometimes we're busy because we're lazy. Uh, we're too busy because we're too lazy to work out what we should be doing. Uh, and so we just live at the beck and call of other people. Um, so actually, again, just going back, Lord, what, what are the most important things I need to be doing? Uh, and thinking hard about them and then committing to them. And you, you have to say no. You've got to say no to some things in order to say yes to the things that matter most of all. Why not start your day with Inspirational Breakfast, Monday to Fridays from 7am, only on Premier Christian Radio, where faith comes to life.